Israel's first prime minister had a dream to make the Negev desert bloom. Today, the miracle that's blooming in the desert is business. Ben Gurion University of the Negev is Israel's fastest growing and most dynamic university. BGN Technologies, the university's technology transfer company, is responsible for the commercialization of innovations and promotion of inventions by university researchers. BGN Technologies, the technology transfer company of Ben Gurion University, is responsible for the commercialization of know-how and uh, invention created by the university's researcher. We experienced tremendous growth over the last six years. Patent application tripled itself. Hundreds of agreements with industry were signed. We created more than 25 startups uh, based on BGU technologies. It's very important for us to be the first to introduce new technology. It's few years of advantage. When we are looking into new, new areas, we always come from the operational side. The researchers know the technology, we know better the, the application, and you need to close the gap. The research without it involving imaging of concealed objects. We can image through handbags and, and suitcases and so on. You want the researcher to be practical. BG Negev understand the importance of that both for the university, for the researchers, and for the, and for the industry. Many times I came to BG Negev and I asked for a particular solution, and they would help me find the expert who may help in completing this solution. I'm opening a center of excellence in Be'er Sheva for uh, EMC and RSA because the business ecosystem is, is still sparse. The academic uh, environment is rich. In our joint effort of EMC and BGU, we're going to develop what I think will be cutting-edge storage software management tools for storage in the cloud, which is now a very, very hot topic. Normally, researchers do not have good business understanding. So matching researchers with businesses is really the job of BG Negev, and I think that they are doing a fantastic job. Innovation is the key to growth. Innovation is the key to competitiveness. Our Deutsche Telekom Labs laboratories located at creative innovation centers such as Berlin, California, and very importantly in Beersheba. Over the past years, we added a much more institutional approach to our business relations. From operating a unit of Deutsche Telekom Labs in Beersheba to the global enterprise R&D cooperation framework between the State of Israel and Deutsche Telekom. We're doing all kinds of uh, projects related to uh, usability and uh, security. We are proud that we're active in Israel. The Ben-Gurion University of the Negev has a center of biotechnology. In the United States, there are one million heart attacks a year. So the question is, how can one prevent this process of stretching, thinning of the heart leading to congestive heart failure? And the answer is a material which is extracted from brown algae, it provides a splinting of the heart so that it heals in a normal structure. BG Negev, this interface between academia and industry, and then a company like Acaria can really make a big difference in the future of many, many people's lives. Our research at BGU is really pioneering, and we are really at the frontier. And the results that we get from our work with industry has a real impact. This whole thing is about bridging. That's what uh, BG Negev does, and they do it fantastically well. It is taking a theoretical idea to the phase of uh, final product. They can give our students exposure and opportunity 
to see cutting-edge technology as it is being developed. BG Negev helps transform ideas into products. They go beyond what the commercialization office at the university normally does. It gives us really the ability to have uh, a technology edge. It gives you a big competitive advantage in the market. We are glad to work together to find new solutions for the patient's benefit. It has become another heartland of innovation. From concept to product, BGN Technologies is here to bridge the gap, creating a smooth development path for innovative ideas and technologies for the scientists as well as the business sector. I think it's a win-win situation.